Hi there, it's Karen and Lucy from Ginger Jive and this is a memory jogger from our Burfield Dips and Drops workshop. If you're following along with these at home, please check out the safety disclaimer and we hope you enjoy the video. So the first move we did was a comb lean dip. It started right to right, stepping away, stepping in, turning the ladies anti-clockwise. Dip the hand, take it over the head, coming in side to side for the lean. As we went into the lean, the lady's going to drop her left foot across between the guy's legs. And from there, the man's going to gently twist on her side. We're going to swap over, lady's left hand going round and into a lean. From here, we can really finish it as we want to. You can just bring the lady up, send her out and back. So to account, it's going to look like this. We're going to step back, turn, over, swap, and then send the lady out. So the side to side lean, left to right, stepping away, coming in side to side, down and face. You're going to swap sides, the lady's going to offer your left hand. From here, as you're going to wrap the lady in, you're going to get your hand onto the lady's waist, sliding round onto the back. Ladies, the right hand comes up round the guy's shoulders and then down into the lean. So to account, it looks like this. You're going to go seven, eight, you're going to step back, in and away, throw down and catch, round and into the dip and then however out you want to. We're then going to do a similar one. It's a side to side where the man wraps in as well. So man's left to lady's right, stepping away. Drawing the ladies in and block, push down to face. You're going to swap side once, ladies offering that left hand. You're going to swap side twice, now off in your right. From here, the man's going to wrap in like a man spin. The left arm's going to go over the lady's head. He's going to lock her arm in as you swap sides and then taking the ladies round into a dip. It's probably easier with this one if ladies your hand comes up and round the guy's back. So to account it's going to look like this. It's going to go seven, eight, we're going to come back, in and away, throw down and catch, throw down and catch the guy comes in, hand goes over, collect the lady and down. The drop kick. Going to right to right stepping away, starts like a sway. You're going to sway the lady in, offering your spare hand. You're going to cradle the lady back, cradle the lady forward. From here, nudge the lady out, and so you're directly behind her. As you bring the lady back, the arms go through. And ladies, you can either hold on or you can take your arms out to the side as the guy gently lowers you back. Be careful not to bang the lady onto your leg. Back up. And then you can just spin off the elbow and catch. So to account, it goes seven, eight, stepping back and in, cradle back, cradle forward, push, pull, down, up, round and catch. So the elbow dip starts off like a whirlitzer, so left to right, stepping away and offer. In and flatten the left hand, and as you push down to turn the lady out to the side, guys, you're going to quarter turn as well. From here, you're going to wrap the lady in, your right hand goes over the lady's head, onto the lady's shoulder, as you turn the lady round, the left arm goes over your shoulder, and you come in for a dip. Now you can either continue to hold on, or if you find it uncomfortable, you can let go, and then into the dip. So to account, it's gonna go seven, eight, stepping back, in, out, round, and down. So for my section, we started off looking at the basic hook dip. So we started off with the guy's left and uh, followers right. So we're going to take a step away. Now you can do the basic hook dip off of any right, uh, left-handed return. So as we return the ladies anti-clockwise, you then place the lady's hand up and under, and ladies, you're just hooking on to the guy's shoulder. And uh, what we're going to do is, leaders, you can either place your right hand in front of the lady's waist, or you can take your right hand up behind their back, so the back of your hand is between the lady's shoulder blades. 
From there, all we do is we just gently lower the ladies back into uh, the drop. Now, the ladies are holding on with their right hand. So they're in a little bit of control. So if I let go, Lena's actually holding on with her right hand. We can then just bring the ladies back up, and then you can just either spin out of the move, or you can come out in different variations. So using the principles of the hook dip, we started off with a Wurlitzer hook dip. So we started a double hand hold, both stepping away. We're going to step in, we're going to flatten the left, keep hold of the right, we turn the ladies out to the side like a normal classic beginner's Wurlitzer. From here, we're going to step in and we pull down and raise the right hand, turning the ladies underneath. You lower the right hand, changing hands behind your back into your left, that's the leaders, not the followers, turning the ladies anti-clockwise once again. As we come out of the move, you place your right hand around the lady's waist, and ladies, you're going to hook underneath the guy's armpit and just hook on to their right shoulder. From here, we take a step to the left, ladies, you take a step back onto your right foot as we lower you down into the drop. We then gently bring you back up, and you can come out many different ways. You can either pull on the waist and spin the ladies out, or you can just simply step out, sliding out, double hand hold. So the count on this looks like this. We went back, flatten the hand, out to the side, raise the right, raise the left, into the hook, into the drop, up, and out. We then looked at the elbow hook dip. So we started off double hand hold as we both stepped away. Leading the ladies forward, you take the hand out to the right first, taking your elbow over the lady's arm and locking over the top. At the same time we do that, we let go of our right hand and place our right hand on the lady's right shoulder. We let go of our left hand and retake hold of the lady's hand that's on our right shoulder. From here, we lead the ladies down, gently pushing down with your right hand, raising your left, ducking your ladies underneath that right right arm. Continue turning the ladies, still keeping in contact with the ladies with your right hand, and then the ladies can then get their right arm up and over the guy's shoulder into that hook position. From here, we can then take a step to the side. Ladies, you take a step back into that hook dip drop. As we lead the ladies back up, once again, you can either spin the ladies out with the right hand or just simply come out and slide out double hand hold. So the elbow hook dip goes back, elbow over, out, change hands, retake, duck, hook, into the drop, up, and out. The lasso dip, or drop. What we're going to do is start the lasso drop from a figure of eight. So we're going to step back right to right. From here, guys or leaders, you turn to the left, taking your right hand over the top of your head, dropping your right hand in front of your face as you change places, raising your right hand, turning the ladies underneath, stepping back. Now, from here, we should have a little bit of a pull here, a little bit of tension here, which is what we want for the next part of the turn. As we step in, we're going to raise that right hand, returning the ladies anti-clockwise, dropping that hand down, letting go as the ladies continue to spin. As she continues to spin, as she comes around, she's going to take her right hand and she's going to take her right hand across the guy's, uh, around the guy's neck. From here, we've still got hold of the lady's waist. Using your left hand to support the ladies round by the shoulder blades, we take a step to the left as the lady steps back on their right foot, luring the ladies into the drop. As we bring the ladies back up, you can then just send the ladies out with the right hand into a free spin, catching with either hand. The lasso drop goes back, turn, turn the ladies and prepare, turn, round, collect into the drop, and up, we'll send out into the spin and catch, just finish with a return and back. The lasso dip turn. We started off right to right, we step in doing a figure of eight, so we take that right hand over our head, drop it in front of the face, turning the ladies underneath. Now very similar to the lasso drop, However, what we're going to do is we're going to raise our right hand, turning the ladies. Now, when we drop that right hand, spinning the ladies, we're going to place our right hand on the lady's left shoulder blade. As the lady continues to turn, she's going to take her left hand over the top. She's going to take her right hand underneath, then swing underneath our right arm as she continues to turn. And then we can just collect the lady once she comes up into a first move hold. To get out of this, we can either turn the ladies out like a first move, or we can go into a basic first move seducer, turning her out to the side. The lasso dip turn. We're going to go back, turn, turn the ladies and face, turn, collect, sweep under, collect, and then from here, you would either do the first move, or you just go into that seducer. The salsa drop. 
We're going to take a step back. We've offered that spare hand. To prepare our ladies for the salsa drop, we're going to bring our ladies to our right-hand side, push away with the left hand, sending it out to the side. Very similar to a Wurlitzer position. From there, as you wrap your ladies in, ladies, you're going to spin, taking your spare hand over the top. You continue to spin until you face the men. Then from here, you're going to do a palm-to-palm -palm hold, and then you're just going to take hold as the guys extends their right arm in front, bringing the left hand up to the left shoulder. It's a little bit awkward doing this move slowly, but um, the, what you're going to be doing is you're going to lower the ladies down, as she goes down, you're going to step over the top of the ladies and then bring her back up again to face. So we end up facing the opposite direction. So the salsa drop goes back, in, out to the side, spin, collect, down and up. The New York sweep starts off with the guy's left to the lady's right. We're going to step away, offering that spare hand. Starts off like a quick basket. So you wrap the ladies in one movement, sending her back. Keeping a hold of the left hand, nudging with the right forearm, send the ladies back out in front to prepare for the spin. Now, as we pull round with this left hand, you're going to wrap the ladies in. Ladies, you're going to take your left hand over the right as you spin in. And as you come in front of the guys, guys, you've got your both arms underneath the ladies' armpits. The ladies are then going to drop down onto the guys' arms, and they're just going to open their legs out to the side, pointing their toes as the guy sweeps you around and then send you back up at the end, collecting right to right. You can finish with a return if you wish to, and then step in back at the end. So the New York sweep goes back, wrap, out we go, prepare, in, drop down, up, and out, return, and back. <laughs> <laughs>